best job to have at BMT, hands down, is chow runner. Everyone will try to tell you, don't be chow runner, don't be chow runner. Trust me, it is worth it. I remember like, when I was first gonna be chow runner, I actually almost started like, like I was having a panic moment. And my MTI looked at me and he was like, have some confidence. Like, I was freaking out. I was like, oh my gosh, how am I gonna do this? But hands down, like you get so much confidence from chow runner. It's actually pretty fun at the end. And honestly, I would say go for it. Just, just do something crazy while you're there. Like what do you have to lose? The best BMT job I'd say would be either the shoe liners or the better liners. They have one of the easiest jobs. Pretty much stress-free. They're the ones that finish the fastest. Best job at BMT, by far, hands down, EC monitor. They get to make the schedule and pretty much decide when you sleep and when you don't. And of course they get to cut themselves in and get all the sleep they want. So that would be my vote for best job. Second best, I'd say with my job, I was fire monitor. All that meant was I had to take out the trash every night and I stood outside the DFAC, yelled some lines, and eventually everybody came in for dinner and I actually got a little bit of extra time because I was in the back of the formation and sat down last. So I did get some extra time for that. So my job. I thought was the best. I had flight office. The easiest detail you could ever have. Literally all you do is go into the MTI's office and like dust a couple things and like clean the windows and that's it. And like the good part about that is you get to have like the in on what happens that week. So there always be like papers all around the office and me and my friend like always like sneak around like look around like what are we doing this week? And also like the element leaders, they'd always like have those like notebooks that they'd like gossip about everyone. We call it the snitch book. Um, me and my friend would always like read it and then like tell the rest of the flight like what they said. So I was like, <laughs> oops. And then also like notes that people would slide under the door. Probably shouldn't be saying that, but we like reread those too. So thanks. Oh no, she didn't. So that was definitely the easiest job. And you also got to like listen in on like the MTI's conversations and stuff when they're in there. And that was really funny. The best job is probably like bed liner. It's pretty easy. I was EC monitor, so as I was doing the EC stand, I'd finish that up and help the better liners. It was a pretty easy job from what I did as well. The best job to have at BMT is probably the day room crew because you pretend to wipe down a whiteboard and that's it. If you're looking to be lazy when it comes to details, I got stuck with weapons monitor, which I didn't do anything when it came to uh, details. I went to the intercom and told CQ how many weapons there were and if they were accounted for or not. If you're looking for something to do, latrine, it's really easy if you and your crew get it down, but it keeps you busy and it's actually a lot of fun. I usually helped out there because I didn't mind it. My favorite job was the job I got, Chrome's. That was the best, so I'm not sure if they have it in the Disneyland dorms, but in the Alcatraz dorms, the building is kind of segmented and on those segmented areas they have Chrome all along the floor line and everything. So it was really easy because Chrome is just getting a cotton ball, wiping it down, and then just keep on wiping until it's all shiny and everything. And going across the entire hallway. Wax on, wax off. Don't forget to breathe. Very important. So it was a fast job. And as you figured out, like, I'm gonna use a clean and a clean cotton ball and go all the way down. And, and I could be done within about seven to 10 minutes, not bad. Other jobs were like legit 20 minutes to do for some people. I liked it. The only downside of it is that that chrome is across a walkway. So every time someone stepped on it, you could hear that metal just clack and you know someone just screwed up your chrome. And even sometimes MTIs would even purposely step on that. So that was kind of a bummer. But um, I personally liked chrome. Um, if I had uh, another choice, I would choose laundry. In laundry, Doing the laundry crew, however you're handling people's nasty nastiness, they did have the most time to their BMTSG, which is like awesome. So yeah, you had the most downtime.